Hello everyone. Hi folks. Well, welcome to the Dog and Park. It's a place of fine and craft ales. And that's a shock revelation in the bar today because as you can see, we've got Al behind the bar. All right folks. Today we're very excited because today we have got Coach from the Tiny Rebel Brewing Company. This is the kit by Muntons. The guys at Tiny Rebel have brew, teamed up with these guys to produce an authentic beer kit. And produce, hopefully, an ale that tastes exactly like the guys make at Tiny Rebel. Coach is from Wales and it stands for cuddles apparently. Does it? Yeah, it stands for what? Cuddles. Cuddles? Yes. Don't call me that. <laughs> it's a 4.6 Welsh red ale and I'm going to be the blind taster today. Yeah. What we're going to do is we're going to blindfold Dave. He's going to taste each of these two beers. One is from his pump, one is from the bottle. Uh, and basically we're going to try and see if he, which one he prefers and which one he likes best. Yes, of course, you can get the beer. Coach, straight from the guys at Tiny Rebel Beer and Company. We've got one of these bottles in the bar today, so we can taste which is going to be which. Just let me get the mystery blindfold. Let's just hide scarf, here we go. <laughs> let me pull this on. Oh, don't wander too far that way, lad. <laughs> I can't, I can't see where I'm going. I don't know if I'm in camera anymore or shot or anything. Just come back this way, come back towards the voice, back towards the light. Back towards the light. Well, no light. <laughs> Bit further this way, here we go. All right, here's beer A. Right, here you go, mate. Let's try that. Nice floral hoppy smell. Nice and smooth. Just turn to your right a little bit more. There you go. <laughs> you nice, see folks? <laughs> nice, nice and smooth. A nice caramel hit to the back of the tongue. Those hops really coming through. Tie us together into the back of the tongue with a nice dry bitterness. A fantastic beer. I must say from the guys at Tiny Rebel. I can see this is why this is a Award winning okay, championship. Got that beer. one off you. Right, second one coming in. That's this one, folks. Right, here you go. There it is. Back. Again, those those hops are coming through the back of the back of the nose there. A nice floral finish to them. And this one's a bit more caramely. The hops are still strong in there. This one's not quite so smooth, there's a bit more of something going on in there, I can't quite put my tongue on it, it's, it's probably a little bit of licorice mixed in there. All in all, another very good beer, obviously again. Yeah, yeah. But Big maybe, question, yeah. which do you prefer? The first one. Right, take your blindfold off, give me the beer. Let's do the reveal, folks. Yeah, the first beer was in fact Dave's homebrew. <laughs> Second beer was in fact the bottled beer. So there you go, you pick your own beer. There you go. I brew beer better than the tiny guys at Tiny Rebel Brewing Company. <laughs> Sorry guys, but you know, you either got it or you haven't. I know you've got it, but I've probably got it even better. It's still a very good beer. It is a very good beer indeed. Whichever way you decide to drink it, whether you decide to drink it in the Dog and Park View or make your own brew kit, or get it from what from the guys from Tiny Rebel. It is a fantastic beer. I'd give this beer a... 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Yeah, good beer. Very good beer. I think we're going to have a few more, isn't it? Yeah, we are indeed. Well, that's it for now, folks. Until next time when you join us in Dublin Partridge. Cheerio!